Hello everybody and welcome to this video where things are loud outside. My hair looks wrecked and this is like the 10th video I've done today. Um, I'm really tired. I don't really know what day it is, but I'm trying to power through it. In this video, I have written in my notes and I don't know what the fuck I'm talking about, but there's a part of me that feels like if I just run the liquor, something good will come out of this. So let me explain it to you like this. I had a dream. I had a dream last night and I don't really know exactly what was happening in it. But one thing I do know that was happening in it, we were having a poetic anarchy retreat where all the anarchy crew like gets together and we stay at some hotel and have like conferences and, you know, just do like what we do here, but together for like a week or something like that. That was what was happening in the dream. And through all of this, through the stuff that was happening in said dream. So one of the things that came up during this dream was the anarchy crew was being accused I, if that's the right word, I don't know if accused is the word I'm looking for here, but the anarchy crew was accused of being a school, like a poetic movement. And like in my dream, I was screaming at these people who said that, like we were yelling at each other and maids were trying to pick up the room because I had trashed a hotel room. Um, very like simple fucking no shit, Sherlock kind of stuff. And um, all this other shit was going on. But then I woke up and I'm like, oh my God, I have to make a video about this. So I was like half asleep and I got my phone and I started slamming my thumbs on it. And it said, um, like, what does it say now? Click movement, two words. And then underneath I wrote schools, clicks, movements. And then I did a slash be better. Okay. I don't know exactly what that means, but I'm hoping as I am talking right now, it will become clear. So anyway, so in my dream, I was like highly offended that I was accused of trying to start a school of poetry. And um, so like the New York school or the beats or the romantics or um, the conversational poets or the meat poets or um, the confessional poets. Did I say that already? I don't know if I did. Um, like just shit like that, like black mountain shit, you know, like, um, like something along those lines. And for some reason in my dream, I was like really upset about it. And I was trying to explain to whoever the fuck I was talking to. I'm like, of course there's cliques in any group. Like you put any like 20 people into a room and within an hour you will notice that some of those 20 people will have branched off into other little groups. Like what the fuck are you talking about? For some reason, the clique argument to me made a lot more sense in my dream. But like I don't know why that would be the argument I have against poetic anarchy being a school of poetry you know like I don't understand why that's like such a big fucking deal but so after like waking up having a cup of coffee um, walking to the store and getting a chalada to like figure out what the fuck is happening um, I was thinking about it and I don't know if that's such a fucking bad idea like maybe it should be a fucking poetic movement like I don't know what makes a poetic movement like do you need to like declare a poetic movement I declare poetic anarchy a movement like what the fuck is that like how do these things happen does someone in some form of academic media have to go now those poetic anarchists over there like, is that how that happens? I don't even fucking know how this happens. 
but the more I was thinking about it, I was like, fuck yeah, dude. Like, poetry is, like, in the shits right now, dude. Like, most poets take themselves too seriously, and the poets that don't take themselves too seriously, the poets that do take themselves too seriously, don't consider even poetry. So it's like, like, it, it's, what's that fucking saying? Um, cut off your nose to spite your face. Is that how it goes? Whatever. That's how I feel like it is. And so I was going through all of these thoughts and then I, I kept looking at the thing and it just says, be better. Be better. So I don't know if I was saying to myself, if you're going to be a school, if you're going to be a movement, be better. Be, like, the best, like, school or movement you could be. Or, if I was saying to myself, subconsciously, you could be a school, you could be a movement, or you could just be better. And be better than all that shit. So I don't know what the fuck it means. Like, if you guys want to get all Freud on me and analyze my fucking dreams, um... Let me know what you think this means in the comments down below. And if you're really good at it, I'll tell you some fucking terrifying, horrific dreams that I've been having that you could fucking chew on a fucking cigar for and let me know what you think those are. Jesus fucking Christ, dude. I will make your fucking head spin and your fucking shorts fill up. God. Those of you who are more intelligent than me when it comes to this stuff, how are schools made? Who makes the school? Who makes the movement? Who does these things? Let me know. So that'll do it. That'll be it. So until um, next time, keep buying my books. Last Chance for Gas, out now on my Etsy shop. Links down below. Type hard, everybody. And just be better. I just want to give a quick thanks to those people who make these videos possible. Anarchy Crew and my followers on Patreon, I appreciate the hell out of you guys, and thank you so much for keeping me going to keep this content possible. You guys are awesome. And if you'd like to join the crew or the Anarchy Crew, just hit the join button beneath this video. And if you'd like to become a member of my Patreon, you can run over to the link down below to do that as well. Thank you.